Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Fall Guys. And we have a special episode of Fall Guys this week as it is the beginning of Season 2. I didn't even realize the first season had ended already. It was via an update file I saw that booted this up yesterday and uh, saw that this was all brand new. Including, you know, with a brand new season here with the Free For All Free Guys, there's a new season pass. This new season pass is Go For Launch, featuring stellar costumes like Hatsune Miku, Xenomorph, and Mr. Spock, plus a whole heap of show bucks. Now, if you're wondering why I might sound like a little different this morning, a little lower or anything like that, it's because it's very early in the morning as I'm recording this. Still trying to wake up, got my cup of coffee here, and trying to keep things moving, shaking and baking, you know. Life of a working man between the week and then the weekend. You know, it's got to keep moving, shaking and baking. So we got that. And you have our season pass, which means you can unlock premium tier rewards, instant rewards, and the Android X, play to earn, blah, blah, blah. The season pass bundle adds one new thing, which allows you to fast track 25 tiers. Now, you don't see the uh, amount on screen here because I already got the season pass, but the regular season pass on the left is worth 950, and the season pass bundle is worth 2800, which, in my opinion, not fucking worth it stick with the regular season pass on this one should you have the show bucks to spare i ended up having to spend eight bucks to get the pre appropriate amount of show bucks and i still have 50 left over from my remaining stuff so this season i'm going to try to see if i could save 950 for the next tier so i don't have to for next season so i don't have to worry about buying it but as you can see here here is the tier system it does go all the way once again to tier 100 but something different that they did for this season that I really, really appreciate. Uh, an issue I had with the last season is that after you reach the final tier, you really didn't have any extra incentive whatsoever. Now, you can see after 100, 101, 102, 103, and they're covered with crown shards. There are a couple of extra costumes in between, like specialty costumes, but uh, it's mainly crown shards up all the way up to tier 200. They doubled the number of tiers this season. So that way you can gain some more incentive. And these 30 crown shards, you need 60 to create a whole crown. So I counted all of this. There's a total of about 45, 46, or 47 crowns total just from this tier system alone, assuming you do not get anything else from uh, objectives that you obtain. Uh, Neandroid Omega, uh, this is the last uh, two, two costume sets. Switch to my Tails costume. Uh, I don't think we're going to be playing Tail Tag in this episode since this is the beginning of a brand new season here. Uh, and as you can see, the experience and the reward system has changed a little bit with the varying amounts to accommodate for the new season. We're going to play 3, 2, 1 Space. We're going to explore space in these new rounds. Season 2 is space themed after all. And we're going to stick only with the space rounds in this episode just to familiarize ourselves with the new games. See what's out there. See what's brand new. I still need to beat Hexer Ring from the previous season. So if I can reach the final in this one, let's see what brand new games we have in store for that. For the finals, at least. But there is a team game my buddy did warn me about uh, in regards to that. But uh, maybe we'll come across it. Maybe we won't. We'll see. Let's tune in and find out. Ooh, a space race. We're going to navigate the obstacles and race to the finish line. It's a race. Oh, it's like the beginning of last season a little bit with the race tracks. We're starting some races this round as well. Can this game fucking load already, please? One thing I'm probably going to end up trying to do or one that end up doing is I'll probably end up switching to my hotspot. I haven't had to do that in so damn long for this, but hopefully I don't get any issues with disconnect. Oh, it's it's teams. It's teams. I did. Okay. That just completely changes my perception of this. Ooh, okay. Wow. Okay, you know what? Fuck that. I'm just... Okay. Be right back. All right. We are back with another game, Cosmic Highway. Hop across the space lanes and reach to the finish. Race to the finish, I should say. Keep it moving, shaking and baking. Of course, like I mentioned, this was teams, and uh, yeah, not a fan of team shit. Uh, come on.
Team of Squad of Four. Let's go. So far, so good. Seems to be pretty simplistic. Ooh, conveyor belts that switch around. Oh, goodness. Beautiful. Just go through the middle. Okay, dive towards the middle, looking good, looking good. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, shit, that bounces. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh, baby. Okay, okay. Damn it. Okay. Was right there, too. All right, we're at the end anyway, so let's just make it to the end and we'll fucking bullshit. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Beautiful. Okay. Second there, made it to fifth place. Top seven can qualify. Hopefully my teammates can make it. We shall see. You got my coffee here. Come on, guys. You can do it. Oh, my God. I do love that planet. That planet in the background reminds me of Little Planet from Sonic CD slash Sonic Mania slash Sonic the Hedgehog in general. So, it's really nice. Tails wasn't in Sonic CD, though, but he was in Sonic Mania. <laughs> and he was in Sonic 4 Episode 2, which Little Planet was also part plot point of. Little Planet has been... Like, I'm pretty sure Little, you can probably do a whole thing, like a whole genealogy arc or a whole fucking canon with just Little Planet and Mobius and all them other fucking areas. Earth. Probably have, like, different universes. Sonic universes. Fucking man. It's just like, we got fucking all universes of all the kinds anyways. All over the damn place. We're right now qualified for third. This man here is a point of way back. That's okay. We're going to qualify anyways, which is nice. But, you know, I'm not going to give anyone shit this episode because, like, this is a brand new season, brand new games. Nobody knows what the fuck they're doing unless they've been playing this beforehand. Um, but, yeah. That's all right. Two, one, and we qualified. Yeah, them fucking flames, uh, the tall guy flames. They got some knockback on them some bitches, I'll tell you that. But the squad managed to qualify from 10 now down to 7, which means 28 beans. See you for that next one. Didn't even decide to fucking weigh or anything. Just went like, yeah, let's just fucking go. Pixel painters touch the floor lights to light them up and copy the picture on the wall. I believe this was the game my buddy told me about. Uh, he said he started to play this automatic victory. Uh, I th funnily enough, I actually had that with the beginning of uh, season six. Uh, it's actually on the first episode of season or the first uh, no, season six, uh, the first episode of the free for all season last season, uh, where I played volleyball and I just automatically qualified from that. So okay, here we go. Top five qualify. Let's, uh, I love me some pixel art, so let's go ahead and keep it moving, shaking. That's one. Motherfucker! Stop! You guys are fucking horrible. Seriously, stop fucking with the damn picture. Thank you. Oh, 
Hold on. Got it. Alright, cool. If you guys will get off the fucking picture. Okay, come on. All right, one more. Got it. All right, cool. Whoo, that game is rough. It'll be a little bit rough with them guys. It's just like, Jesus Christ. See, this is, like I said, like I said before, time and time again, and I'll continue to say it for, for probably as long as I live. This is why I don't fucking do teams. I am much better doing this shit solo. Actually, they need to make this shit solo. They need to make this, uh, pixel painters need to be made solo on this one. Because I would love to see just like the creativity or just how people could be able to get the pixels uh, up on screen there. Hey, it's Little Planet. I'm always going to compare that to Little Planet. I just can't unsee it. Uh, you guys are missing a couple of blocks up top. So. Yeah. You got to know what you're doing with that one a bit. And the, the tiles can throw you off a bit as well. Four squads remaining on to the next round. A new survival game coming into play. Hyperdrive heroes avoid falling off the hoverboard and reach to the finish. Now they're just altering some of the more cl uh, classic games on this one. We went from hoverboard heroes to hyperdrive heroes. Oh, lordy. Okay. So it's not just a copy and paste sort of deal. They fucking added a shit ton of this. Oh, my God. All right, here we go. Get over there. Sweet. Okay, cool. Wait a tick. Wait a tick. There you go. Now you have these platform here that move left and right. Nice little bounce off. Ooh, okay. Nope. We'll wait for the hoverboard on this one. I already have a partner that uh, is hasn't qualified. Luckily, they do come back up with these gonals, with these hexagonals. Whoa, hello. Okay. Ooh, that was close. Oh, okay. I lost a partner. There we go. Sweet. Go, my dude. Right here. All right, cool. Looks like we're near the end of this. This is pretty fun. <laughs> uh, okay, so how do we get it? Okay, I was going to say, like, we got to wait for the hoverboard. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. 
Oh my goodness. Just run, 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 run. Woo. Wonderful. All right, we made it too. Nice. Whew. That, that, it get, oh my God, my nerves. <laughs> that one will give you run for his money. I do like that one. That's really great. This is the last round. Ooh, Hexaterrestrial. A final round. Four places fall away temporarily. When you stand on them, keep moving and survive the longest to win the crown. Or crown shards in this case. Now that we are actually starting a brand new season, my counter for the previous season is all set back to zero. So I ended season one with three solo wins, three group wins for the season, uh, for the recorded episodes. And uh, let's see if we can get started here with uh, a win here. Yeah, so they're temporary, which means they will come back up eventually. But the area, the playing field is quite huge at the moment. So I'm assuming that at some point, there's going to be some kind of uh, tiles falling or there's gonna be some way to try to speed up the process on this one. Or they could stay low for a little bit longer as well. That can work too. Five eliminations have occurred so thus far. Yeah, the tiles are not lasting for much longer, so the more tiles that fall apart, the longer they stay down until we can get some more. Oh, the walls are caving in too. Ah well. I knew that was gonna do it, but you know, let's let's watch the rest of this, cause this is gonna this is interesting. I like this. The walls are coming in. Oh, there went my last partner. That's okay. They it looks like that team won it, or if they're part of a team, looks like they won. But anyways, that's gonna do it. Extraterrestrial. Elimination, but you know what? Good GG's to the team that did win on this one. Greatly, wonderful, wonderful done on that. They got some uh, glitches they need to update and some uh, sound effects that they need to update and some shit. So, of course, that is the case with every new season that starts off. You know, it always starts off buggy and shit until they, you know, decide to update it later on. It's just like, okay, cool. I wish they fucking got it right the first time, but you know what? That's just me and that's just how gaming works nowadays, unfortunately. Remember the back of the day when you actually had a game and actually came completed? So, 2,600 experience points just for playing any show, which is nice. 35, 48. Ooh, level 2, monochrome. Oh, yeah, the experience and all that stuff. Definitely going to be worth coming back to this every day, even after getting the tears. And I have a feeling it's going to take me a lot longer to get to there. All right, gotta go back again with three, two, one, space. See what other games are out there. Hopefully, games that we haven't played yet. See if we can actually get a group win on this one. But we'll see how it goes. I'll see you for the first round. Here we are, back again with Cosmic Highway. I mean, we played this one already, but you know what? A okay, a okay. More practice just means more fun, and you know what? We're eventually gonna go play through more of these eventually throughout the season, anyways. So let's keep it moving, shaking and baking. I thought, even with the hotspot connection, this shit was going to fucking disconnect. My heart went to my ass. I'm not going to lie. And I'm just like, I do not, I don't need this bullshit to continue. I love this game. Although I hate this game. But I love it. I love it still. Okay. You piece of shit. I managed to avoid getting knocked down by that. And that's what knocks my ass over? Fucking seriously? Good lord, the frame rate's taking a hit. So much shit going on at the same time. So much processing. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, okay, that was damn near close. Beauty. F fuck. Okay. It's almost at the end, anyways. We can still make. We can still qualify if we make it. I had an a, a, a partner disconnect, so right now we're in fourth. So that's fucking fantastic. I love that shit. Oh my god, please don't do this to me. Beautiful. All right. One more par par partner partner that's needed. Uh, a couple tiers back. Not too bad. Not too bad. Tall guy. Long guy. Draven Turkey 2012. Here we go. Ooh, getting bounced back by them tall things. Yeah, them things. I swear, it's like, I don't know if they changed the bounciness, but, uh, or specifically just for this season or for these games, but it feel like it's a little bit more of a bounce back. It doesn't feel like by much, but damn, do you get hit? Do you fucking feel it? We're in seventh right now. Oh, no, buddy. You need to make it through. You need to make it through. <sighs> okay. This is why I don't understand for some players. This is a very idiotic move. Just because you're in the middle, like, you're in a full circular platform. There's no way for you to fall unless you take fucking forever to get to left or the right to move forward. But you see the bouncy spring in the middle. Why the fuck would you even bother with it? It's like it just pushes you up. You're not fucking doing anything like that. Okay, now you're just now you're just not even trying. Yeah, you weren't even trying at that point. All right, let's get the hell on out of here. Venture to the satellite by plane. Oh, yeah. I still haven't shown that off yet. Speaking of a 3-2-1 space, there should be a nice little thing coming up here. Right here. So, right now, venture into the satellite by playing 3-2-1 space. So, we got to play that three more times. Play squad shows, duos, main, reach round two, round three. So, you get space bean, kudos, Nameplate, satellite nameplate, mission patches design, and you get a satellite replay backpack uh, once you reach the full end of here. So, uh, in terms of special, season two starter pack for 10 bucks, 1,000 show bucks. You get your make an impact, you get the tops, the bottoms, all that good stuff. Uh, Ghost gadget bundle. Should you be interested in any of that? I, I'm not interested in any of this crap. I do, I, I'm more of a licensed person type of. Uh, type of guy when it comes to this uh, these kind of games so button bobbler you know all the fun shit here but i think for now we're gonna call it an episode for the beginning of season two free for all here for fall guys fridays next time we do come back to this i'll probably keep the tails costumes and you know, i'll do a solo show just to see if we can get that tail tag going but uh, next week on the channel it will be uh, more of uh, kirby's avalanche i do believe yes i do have that part uh, uploaded already and then from there, we'll see where the LPs go from there. But until next Friday for Fall Guys Fridays, do like to thank you guys for watching. Hope you have yourselves a fantastic day. Love, peace, and chicken grease. Good night.